Ukraine and Russia are on Wednesday holding a day-long ceasefire to allow humanitarian corridors for evacuating citizens trapped in the fighting. In latest reports by news agency AFP, Russia has said that it is not trying to overthrow the Ukrainian government. Foreign Ministry spokeswoman Maria Zakharova said during a press briefing that some progress has been made in talks between the two nations. Russia and Ukraine had been meeting at Belarus border to negotiate to end the fighting. The ministry spokeswoman said another round of talks would focus on humanitarian corridors to evacuate civilians. Zakharova said Russia does not aim to occupy Ukraine or overthrow its elected government. She said the goal is not destruction of Ukrainian statehood, nor are the actions directed against the civilian population. Zakharova accused Ukrainian authorities of sabotaging the evacuation operations by not communicating them to the civilians on time. She said Ukraine was responsible for civilians being stranded in cities where heavy fighting was underway. Moscow had this week offered to set up evacuation corridors that were unacceptable to Ukraine because some of them led to Russia. Zakharova said that persons wishing to evacuate to Russia were being forced to western Ukraine. She claimed 2 million Ukrainians wanted to evacuate to Russia. The UN refugee agency UNHCR has pegged the total number of Ukrainian refugees at 2.2 million. Ukraine president, meanwhile, Volodymyr Zelensky said he is no longer pressing for NATO membership for Ukraine, a delicate issue that was one of Russia's stated reasons for invading its pro-Western neighbour. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.